Good evening. Tonight, police are combing through surveillance footage to help capture a killer. APD is investigating the shooting death of a witness to a suspected armed robbery near an Albuquerque park. Here's News 13's Courtney Allen. Courtney. Jackie, police say 21-year-old Kayla Compost was playing Pokemon Go with her boyfriend before she was shot to death. Tonight, her friends tell me they're still in disbelief. She's helped me through everything, and she's always been there, and now she's gone. Cody Bell is holding back tears. I'm really trying not to break down right now. When talking about his best friend, Kayla Campos. I feel like there's a piece of me that's missing now. Bell says he's known Campos for around eight years, inseparable ever since their days at El Dorado High School. She was such an amazing person, and she was my closest friend. And, like, I'm just devastated that she's gone. Campos was shot and killed Friday near Bianchetti Park just before midnight. Bell says she was doing what she does every night. Her and her boyfriend, they always make a loop around this park playing Pokemon Go every night before they go home because their apartment is literally like right there. Police say she and her boyfriend saw people robbing someone in a car on Granite Avenue. When she tried to drive away, multiple shots were fired into her car, striking Compost in the back of her neck. Her car crashed right into this home, boarded up today. We saw in the cameras the car driving through the park right in front of our house. Mary and Kane Light, who live four doors down, provided this surveillance footage to police, showing what they believe is Compost's car just moments before it crashed. Even in a nice, quiet neighborhood, like a family neighborhood like this, that, you know, there still will be dangers and violence happening all the time. Like, it's scary. Bell says his best friend was simply in the wrong place at the wrong time. Just knowing that I'm, I'm never going to see her again or talk to her, I'm just sorry that her life was taken away so soon. Bell says Campos had aspirations of becoming a dentist one day. He also says most of her family lives in Arizona, but they're now in town and ask for privacy during this difficult time. Jackie, back to you. Okay, thanks, Courtney. Police have not revealed a suspect, but they do say the robbery involved a red car that's possibly a Ford Mustang and a silver four-door sedan. Anyone with information is urged to reach out to APD.